Welcome to our tutorial on sending a PowerMail in your databank. This is meant to be a crash course on the steps you take to set up and send a bulk email to a list of people. First, run a search for the people you would like to receive the PowerMail by selecting Personal under the Search menu. Type in your search criteria and then click Find. You now have your list selected and are ready to create your PowerMail. To get into PowerMail, go to Selection, PowerMail. Open the folder on the left-hand side that contains the template you wish to use by clicking on the name. Select a template from the list on the right. The first screen you will see is the preview screen. To edit your template, you're going to follow these links at the top from left to right, ending with the publish link. So let's start with properties. This is where you're going to enter the subject, sender name, and sender email address. You can also choose a folder to put the email in. When you have finished, click the Save Changes button. Next, we're going to click on the HTML link. This is where we're going to create the HTML version of our PowerMail. You can edit the template by simply replacing the current text. You can also insert pictures and edit the tables. When you're finished, click the Save Review button. And next, let's click on the text link. This is where you're going to create the text version of your PowerMail for people who have specified that they want a text-only version. As a shortcut, click on the Import button. This will import all of the text from your HTML message. It will most likely require some cleaning up, but it's must, much faster than starting from scratch. When you're finished, click Save. Next, let's click on the Telefriend link. This is where you can set the greeting, suggested message for friend, and text for the thank you page. When you're finished, click Save. We're now ready to publish. Go ahead and click on the Publish link. The Publish page gives you the option to send a test message before sending the real message. It's a good way to see what the message will look like for your recipients. Below that is the Real Send box. The databank has remembered our list we selected before, so it's all ready to send. Tell it if you want it to send later and choose a time, or choose Send Now. When you're ready, click Send to Members, and then click OK. You can look at the results of your PowerMail by clicking on the Results link once you've sent your message. On this page, you can see how many people opened the message, told a friend, unsubscribed, etc. Thanks for watching our tutorial and good luck!